So could the New Orleans Pelicans be trading away CJ McCollum to the Miami Heat this 2023 NBA offseason? Well, here on the screen is a trade proposal or a trade idea from NBAanalysis.net. The link to this article is down below in case you want to check out the entire thing uh, for yourself. But this trade would see the New Orleans Pelicans receiving Kyle Lowry, Nikola Jovic, and a 2027 first round pick that is top 10 protected, and the Miami Heat receiving CJ McCollum. Now, in my personal opinion, this might actually be a better trade uh, than what the lower trade would have been had the Heat made a trade with the Blazers uh, before Damian Lillard was traded away to the Milwaukee Bucks, of course, now that he is in Milwaukee. All signs sort of point towards the uh, Miami Heat, maybe making more of a plan B trade with players like CJ McCollum, Chris Paul, or even Drew Holiday, uh, who was recently a part of the Damian Lillard trade, getting traded back to the Portland Trail Blazers. Now, if I'd pick a winner of this trade, I'd probably say the Miami Heat because they are getting back a pretty solid player in CJ McCollum, uh, a player that would fit the Miami Heat culture, a player that would fit alongside uh, Jimmy Butler, Bam Adebayo uh, quite well, in my personal opinion, but also too, and more importantly, they're not actually giving up very much assets, in my personal opinion, to make a trade of this magnitude work. Now, for the New Orleans Pelicans, I'd probably want back a little bit more in regards to draft capital or some younger talent. So perhaps a player like Kyle Lowry, I understand why he's involved in the deal, but I wouldn't really want Kyle Lowry, in my personal opinion. Uh, I'd be more centered around players like Tyler Hero, uh, Nikola Jovic, and a first-round pick. So if you're able to sort of swap out uh, Tyler Hero with uh, Kyle Lowry, this would be a much better trade for the Pelicans, in my personal opinion, than what is being presented currently. So... If you are the Heat and you want to trade for a veteran guard, a player that can hopefully, uh, you know, bring you over the hump and win a championship this year, then yeah, I think TJ McCollum at a relatively low asking price is a pretty good way to go if he is in fact available. And if you are the New Orleans Pelicans, I'd probably want back a player like Tyler Hero and Nikola Jovic at the very least in order to get the conversation rolling if I had to be the GM, of course, of the New Orleans Pelicans. So uh, make sure to leave all your thoughts down below. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next one.